what's good everybody it's thunk today we've got camille in the jungle so let's get into it all right maybe you hear my dog in the background there barking i'm sorry about that he is a little bit stubborn um but he means well he means well he's a sweetheart he's one of those dogs that uh his bark is much louder than his bite <coughs> All right, so Camille Jungle. All right, so we're going to go ahead. We're going to do the E Max on Camille. Um, I've seen E and Q. I just think in the jungle, E's better. I just feel like it's much better. So it uh, helps with your mobility, helps with your ganking and whatnot. So when you're clearing with, I kept wanting to say Zaya. When you're clearing with Camille, um, you're going to use your Q as an auto reset. Uh, so the way her Q works is. It's basically an auto reset and empowered auto once. And then after a little bit of timer, you get a second empowered auto that does true damage. So our first one uh, deals 16 bonus, bonus physical damage. And then her second one um, deals 32, per 32 and 40, deals 32 AD and 40% of it is true damage. That's how you speak using words. Okay. All right, so what we're going to do with the combo is we do auto into Q. I'm not going to use it here. But we're going to do auto Q, and then we do auto Q. Oh, it's crazy. Actually, I think you fit two autos in between. Let's see if we can't get a level two gank off here. Hey, we got him. So we needed to use a flash. Um... Needed to use a flash there, and there's his teleport. I'm sure he's gonna teleport back. I mean, he's not. He hasn't teleported, but I'm sure he will end up teleporting. <coughs> but that works out. So that's something you can do with Camille. You usually want to take your E second anyway, because it helps a little bit with your jungle clear. Okay, yeah, and there's his teleport. All right, so you see it there. I'll smite that out. And I'll go ahead and do Gromp here. All right, auto Q, auto, auto Q. And you hear it charge up there too, right? And so you get the rhythm of it over time because if you do it too early, you won't get the, you'll get the, you get a little bit of damage. You'll still get like the first proc, but, um, oh no, can I save him? Nope, he did. He did. <laughs> Dang, unfortunate. That's okay. That's really cool. Alright, I'm going to go clean this up. Because the extra experience is nice. Oh, I knew that was going to happen. <laughs> okay, cool. Rip. You did. So the thing with Camille is <coughs> she is really squishy early. Oh, he took this thing, so he's probably doing my raptors here. I'm okay with that. I don't really like to do them anyway. Okay, we're going to go ahead and go for the Trinity Rush as well. Kind of like the same way you do as Jax. That was really good. <gasps> oh, okay. <laughs> I'm not sure that that's worth. Okay. Let's see if I can get him here. Got him. So definitely not worth. Okay. So that's another cool thing you can do with Camille, you saw me do right there, is when you use your E off the wall, oops, I accidentally put a point in Q just by habit, you can uh, fire your W to get the slow. So I got the stun and the slow, at him, slow on him at the same time uh, by using the EW combo. Yeah, sure. Why not? 
<clears throat> that's going to be a nice, easy gank setup later on. Um, just have to wait for him to be a little bit more overextended. Whoever hits is going to get something nice out of it. Whether I hit mine or, you know, Galio lands his stuff. If I land my E or Galio lands his, either way it's going to be good. I don't think they should be going for this. But if they shove him under anymore, I can come over the top and go for this gank. They just warded now. Okay. I'm out. That's why I was okay with standing there, because I knew I was going to be able to get out regardless. Ease mobility. Camille's mobility is really nice. Oh, okay, so there you go. I just, you know, if you didn't catch it, I used my Q a little bit early there, and it didn't do the little backflip signifying that I did the, uh, got the true damage right there. When you do it early, <coughs> you don't get the extra damage, and so she doesn't do her cool little flip. All of my lanes have really good ganks set up. It's just a matter of catching them before they die like that. Oh, snap. Ooh, dang. All right. Dang, gang playing gold. Dang. That would have been a really good play by Rakan there. Because I think they would have had him. The smite early for health here. Uh oh. <laughs> Alright, we're good. No, <laughs> Zaya. No, Zaya. <laughs> All right, cool. So we'll go ahead and get Sheen. We'll start working towards the rest of this trinity. <coughs> and we're out. All right, early game not going too bad, but I feel like they have the scaling on their side. We do have a nice little team fight, though. I won't lie. Between Galio, Ult, Rakan, I mean, I can dive in. Galio can follow up. Rakan can dive in. Galio can follow up. It's going to be nice and gauge. We should look to set that up for a dive bot lane, seeing as they're so immobile. Okay, try and give some, give Urgot some love too. So that's another thing you can do. You can cancel it early, just for the sake of, you know, Okay, I'm gonna go in on the. Got him. <laughs> nice. All right, so that's really good. That's really good. So Camille's old. Um, if you didn't know, she's trolling. Oh my god! Oh my goodness! What is? Woo! What's happening? We're popping off, boys. We're popping off and we're not popping off at the same time. It's beautiful. I love it. Let's keep going. Um, so Camille's ult, the way it works, is it's a targeted ability and it creates a little cage around someone to capture them and keep them in. They can't leave until you leave or until it runs out. So it's really nice. So it has a nice range on it too. So you see the little circle around there. That is about the range of a flash. So let's see if we can't take this. So, you know, you jump on someone, and then they flash away, and then you follow up with your ult. Okay. Put that down there. I'll take this. This just lets them know, hey, I took your stuff. Don't even worry about coming up here. Don't even come up here, because I got it. And he actually might. Might not. Or he might have just seen... Uh, Galio do that and think that Galio got it. But nope, it's mine. I got it. Did 
This was a mistake. This was a mistake. Oh, <laughs> the gangplank ult. Oh, no. Oh, he got it. Oh, nice. And they got the, uh, oh, no. What is he doing there? What is he doing there? That's a heck of a roam. Wow. Unlucky roam. All right, we just about got our Trinity finished up. We're playing all right. We're playing okay. Not bad. Could be better. That death was a bit of an overextension. <clears throat> Hopefully bot lane got a little pressure over that. But we're doing well all in all, I think. Um, how are we losing? How are we down kills? The Zareth. Oh, nice. That's huge. I'm assuming they used ult. Yep. I was going to say, when they get their six, they're going to be nasty bot lane whenever they can combine that. I don't think I need to ult here. Oh my god, he flashed too? That's foolish. <coughs> okay. Okay, his R is ready. We can do this. Clean, baby! So that's exactly what I was talking about right there. When you do your combo onto him, you know they're going to flash away. Like, that pathing of the Xerath was obvious. He's obviously looking to flash away. So as soon as he gets to the wall, I put my R on him, and he can't go anywhere. He ain't going nowhere. Let's go. And I was really counting on when we engaged on the Skarner there. I was really counting on... Um, <laughs> Calio bringing his R and actually when I looked down at the map I noticed that he wasn't walking down <laughs> so that was concerning a bit oh my goodness the damage what I want to go in I'm not sure if he saw me or not which is the problem here maybe you can bait him out here or something I'll hang out a little bit longer. I'm not sure where he's at. There he is. Okay. Echo's a bit harder to dive. So I can see we both, like, all of us were like, oh, we want to do it, but we don't because of that. I should have went bottom with Rakan there. That would have been an easy, easy gank to make, easy play to make happen. And instead she dies. That's unfortunate. That could have been an easy play. It been made. Okay, um, let's go Merc Treads. I'm trying to decide if I want to go into tank from here, or if since I'm snowballing, I want to keep building the damage. Because you don't really, I don't really need too much more damage. I got my Trinity. From here I could go Cinder Hulk. Um, you can go Warriors, or I could go Cinder Hulk into my Tiamat and go, um, you know. Tanky team at <laughs> whatever that's called. <laughs> uh, brain fart moment. Oh no. Oh. Unlucky. Unlucky. I gotta go cover mid. Dang. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, there's Zareth there. Wait. I was wondering, I was like, what is he doing? Why is he doing this? Zarathult, I didn't think about that. Dang. Hmm. You know what I'll do, I'll build, oh, man. I'm just gonna go warrior, that's fine. I'll just go warrior. <coughs> this is good, Urgot went in topside. Gangplank is like face roll easy right now, so that's uh that's really good. That he's winning that match, that matchup. Might even get first tower blood too. First blood tower, first brick, I think is what it's called. Okay, clear out any wards. Safe to assume that they got some vision in our jungle somewhere. All right, not bad. Not great, not perfect, not bad. Okay. Mm, I think he warded right there. That's a popular place for mid laners to put wards. <laughs> They are just scrapping down here. I want them to keep chasing. Okay, cool. So now if they come up, we kill them. Oh no, mid lane. Get it before they do. No. <laughs> and can't play cold Kilver Com. <laughs> oh, unfortunate. <clears throat> I'm gonna sell this and get another control ward. Control wards. Wards win. Games. Okay, there's Echo there. Our team fight is going to be really, really strong. He sees it coming. Man, so close. All right. Oh, that was so close. <laughs> Dang. That Galio is going to be huge, though. That Galio is going to be huge the longer this game goes. <coughs> We need Ergot's help here. I think our team fight's really good. Problem is, I'm not there with the smite, so... Got it! Okay. Go ahead and get on out of there <laughs> as best as we can. Try and go help out. I wanted to go, but I knew I would just get popped immediately, so. <laughs> I 
as much as I want to help. Okay. Woof. All right. Not too shabby. I'm just going to run topside. Collect that. Make sure that that farm doesn't go to waste. It's a huge amount of farm, and he doesn't have teleport. So I want to make sure that it doesn't all go to waste. Remember to use your mobility. Now watch me miss all of this farm. I never claimed to be a laner, all right? That's all I can say about that. <coughs> all right. Where's Zareth? Because if Zareth is up there, I can't win that. I can't win the 2v2. But if it's just her alone, I can win the 2v2. And we out. <laughs> uh, that's funny. I don't know why she was up here by herself. She just saw me, right? Like, maybe she was just doing a power check. Sometimes people want to check and see how strong they are, if they're strong at all. <coughs> She's not as strong as me. I don't, I don't know what that was about. Oh, I love Camille. When she first came out, I spammed her. I was like, this is exactly the champion I love. This is my style right here. I love it. <sighs> and then she got optimized for top lane. And then she got put in the dumpster for a little bit. And now she's back. I can be happy again. Okay. wanted to take that but it's not worth <laughs> not worth Skarner ult and then just getting destroyed so Fuck. I missed. That was a mistake. Oh, I missed. All right. Two bad things happened there. One, I ulted the Skarner. Terrible. Two, I meant to ult Gangplank, and I clicked on Skarner. And then two, that little... Those shenanigans that just happened right there. That... <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're gonna go into uh, <laughs> we're gonna go into GA <laughs> because I'm ahead <clears throat> and we want to maintain that lead a little bit here. Okay. Hopefully, someone cleans up that side. Don't act communist. You just a fan. All right. <sighs> That was rough. I feel like we could have won that a lot harder, but I misplayed too hard. Okay. Okay. So close! I hit my W instead of my Q. I would have had that. Oh, man. That was a close one. <laughs> oh man. 
money. Okay, head over into the dragon. I don't know what that was about. Whoops. Okay. I gotta remember that I have stopwatch. I always freaking forget that I have stopwatch. So I gotta remember that I have that. Did he get that? <gasps> he got that. That's so clean. What? I didn't know you could do that. Okay. <clears throat> Ooh, that was good. That was good. No! I didn't think that was going to kill me or I would have used stopwatch. We don't really need to dive. We can dive, doesn't mean that we should. You know what I'm saying? Just because you can, doesn't mean you should. All right, now I'm gonna work into this and I'll probably get my last item and man, maybe this is too late, but my last item will probably be a tank item. Oh, they burned that thing. Good on them. They melted that. Yeah. Yeah, that was a good play by them. Ugh. This is what I literally just said. We don't need to be diving. Like, we really don't need to dive that deep. <laughs> It's alright though, we got a couple. I agree. I am with you, Zaya. Stop, please. Stop, please, please. Okay. Yeah, so we want to be making picks here. That's how we want to get back into this, is by making pick like, back into it. We aren't really out of it, but we keep over-diving. Like, we don't, we don't need that. We don't have to do that. Which I get it, because they have so much clear, wave clear, they desperately want to dive and just jump on top of them. But they also have a lot of damage. <laughs> A little late. Okay. Okay. Okay, that did not work. That did not work at all. I think they just have too much damage on us. None of us can really go. Okay, that's pretty good though.
That's really good. Dang. Not enough. Not enough. <laughs> Look at the Argot speed! Urgot too fast. <laughs> oh, I love it. <clears throat> I love it. Six legs. Faster than two. <laughs> I wonder if the right play is going Titanic here. Or if it might be better to do s just go ahead and... Well, I already bought that. I already bought Jorm's Fist. Which I could build into that. <laughs> You know what? I'm going to do that. I'm going to go Ravenous instead of Titanic. I'm just going to go full damages and... It's not lies that count, but the darkness of the truth. Go the full damages and uh, maybe do some splitting. Try and make picks like this. I just saw Echo. <laughs> Got him. Clean, baby. Too clean. And there's the dragon. Let's go. Let's go. Okay. Yeah, so the later the game goes too, the less you're going to use your W. You use it as a catch-up and slow tool, but for the most part, you're not really using it. Your autos are going to do more damage, and uh, it takes too much time. And then after you get your Tiamat, oh, split pushing is so easy. It's so nice. <coughs> and Camille, being left alone with the turret, just destroys it because of her auto resets and the Trinity procs. And then, of course, her damage. So, look at that. Look at how much damage I do to the turret. It's insane. I want to go in on this, but I don't know where th his team is. That's what's concerning to me. Woo! <laughs> Team! <laughs> also, he just wrecked me. I didn't expect that either. I just got destroyed. Just got a destroyed. At least I didn't use my GA or anything, so that's good. That's good. Ooh, that damage. Oh, one more auto attack. Oh, no. Dang, she just needed one more auto on her, and that would have been it. That would have been golden. Those three fire drags. Those three fire drags. Let me see. Okay. Sorry, I had to check work real quick. Okay. This is good. This is a good game. 40 to 40. Whew, spicy. Spicy. The problem is, though, is I think that they have the late game advantage. I'm not sure. It's hard to tell, but GP, Sivir, Echo, I mean, uh, it just seems like they do. They can be burning it. They can do it really fast. Okay. Okay. <coughs> We're not sure where they're at, so we want to uh, stay tight here. We got bot side, so we definitely don't want to take any five on fives. I'm just hanging out here, just kind of waiting. Just kind of waiting.
Just kind of waiting. I'm going to go shove out top. Hopefully my team doesn't fight. I'm letting them know. I'm letting them know so that they're careful here. Because we got this 1-3-1 one, one here. is really strong. Now I just have to be careful. Make sure that we see them at all times. I don't see everyone. So I'm going to back off here. Come, 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 come. Okay. Okay, got Sivir. I didn't know that she could uh, spell shield my ult. I played myself. <laughs> I played myself so hard. I was too hype. I was too hype. I got my own head, and it was all over. Uh oh. I was probably in early Zanyas, but oh, the flash ult, the flash ult, <laughs> dang. Yep, yep. Woo, spicy team fights. <sighs> I'm misplaying. I am misplaying so hard. See, all about getting better, all about improving. I panicked, I flashed too soon. I didn't know that Sivir could spell shield my ultimate. That's a thing, apparently. Um, whew. Overall, I'm playing well, but <clears throat> this late game is hard to uh, hard to maneuver, and I'm not doing a great job. Gotta make sure that they're not doing this. Okay. <coughs> they could be doing that. They they are doing that. Yep. I don't think I'm gonna make it in time to do anything here. Yeah. Dang. It's not huge on them, but it would have been huge on us. <laughs> okay. Yeah, well. Oh no, do we all just die here now? Oh, so close. Okay. All right, I like it. I like it. The Galio, Galio Urgot. Can they do it? No, no, they can't. But it was a valiant effort. It was a valiant effort, and I commend them on their try. See money all around me. All right. <clears throat> what? Maybe he just thought, well, I'm dead anyway. All right, well, that's another Baron gone. So that's nice. I'm going to go ahead and keep shoving. I think this 1-3-1 thing could work if we pressure and collapse and fight at the right times. 
truthfully, I'm just happy this is a good game. I haven't had a good game like this in such a long time. Usually the games are either stomps one way or the other. It kind of seems like that's how it happens. It just snowballs out of control, and then next thing you know, one team is winning hard. Okay, Silver top side. I saw Zareth mid. Echo bot side, so we're looking for GP. He's the one on the map. We don't know where he is. <coughs> and then obviously Skarner's dead. So go ahead and take this thing. Clear out this ward. Help up that vision score. <laughs> oh, 67. I'm usually the highest in the game, too. Oh, almost had that second leg proc. But I think this 1-3-1 will one work. My GA's up in 9, so I don't want to waste that. So I'd rather be team fighting with that. Okay. Just the big question is, <coughs> how are we going to get this fight going? Am I about to get collapsed on? Got him. All right, one pick, one pick. We're going to lose inhibs. I'm not sure this is worth. I don't think we can dive them. But we can just win the game. I mean, my goodness. Oh my goodness, we did it! We did it! Ha <laughs> ha! Oh. Woo! What a game! Hit him with the GD dub P. GG dub P! We are. Gucci gang, Gucci gang. What am I doing? I hate that song. Alright, so. Woo! Who gets the honors? All of them. My whole team deserves honors. I'm going to give it to Zaya for saying staying tilt proof. But, man, that was huh, that was a tough game. We got the S minus, though. Played really well. Um, that late game. Whew. So, Camille is a beast. Camille, she is a beast, especially if you can um, get those early game skirmishes and kind of pick people off. That's how you want to play. You definitely want to hop on people, engage fights, use the ultimate defensively, but also to pick off a single person and delay them. You saw the damage late game is insane, but it's all about picking your fights. And if I had gone behind early this game, the beautiful thing of it is that I could have just gone Titanic Hydra and full tank. I'd been, I still would have went Trinity first, but then I would have built Cinder Hulk, and then I would have went into Titanic and full tank. And you can still be a beast because of the true damage proc on her Q. So, all in all, Really good, really good champion. So that was a great game, 40 minute plus. The kills out the wazoo, but we did uh, great team play, got some picks, and we won. So, whew, learned a lot. Um, that's going to be it for me as always. I'm Thunk. Keep your head up and keep grinding.